murder of his pregnant wife and two daughters. He says in his last conference, it's your first look at video of Chris Watts being interrogated about the cold-blooded murder of his pregnant wife and two daughters. He says in his last conversation with his wife, Shanann, he told her their marriage was over. I don't feel like the love we have is there anymore. The interrogation video was released today along with body cam video of police searching Watts' home for the first time. And new details of Watts' secret double life are also being revealed. Watts took this photo of his mistress. That's Watts in the mirror, taking the shot three weeks before the murders. He kept the raunchy image hidden from his wife in a secret file on his cell phone. It's just one of many he took of 30-year-old co-worker Nicole Kessinger during their torrid two-month affair. And this is his actual handwritten love letter. The first day I saw you, you took my breath away. The first time we kissed, I knew I had met the most amazing, unique, and electric woman ever. He signed it love Chris. Life in the Colorado Department of Corrections with no possibility of parole. Watts was sentenced to three consecutive life terms earlier this month. According to the documents, Watts was smitten with Kessinger. He used Google to search when to say I love you for first time. She seems just as smitten. Googling man I'm having affair with says he will leave his wife. Watts' wife, Shanann, suspected that her husband was cheating. She complained he was ignoring her and texted him, think you're with another girl or worse. Four days before the murder, Shanann, who was four months pregnant, became more distraught, texting a friend she had canceled a gender reveal party. Chris said, we are not compatible anymore. He refused to hug me. What the hell changed? He said he'd had time to think. I'm so sorry. I've cried myself to sleep for over a week now. Chris Watts' mistress, Nicole Kessinger, says he claimed he was in the final stages of an amicable divorce, telling the Denver Post, I believed him. Kolla här, det är precis likadan var som den gav till julklapp. Vad då var? Jo, men här på blocket, kolla. Exakt likadan. Body camera videos. Hey, are you Chris? Chris yes. Evidence of a hidden affair. Interrogation tapes. Unraveling the intricate web of lies that made up Chris Watts' secret life, offering clues as to why he murdered his pregnant wife Shanann and their two young daughters. You immediately yes. suspected Chris. Shanann's devastated parents, Sandra and Frank Rusek, speaking out for the first time since their daughter's murder. When I told the police to find his GPS because his GPS is going to tell them where my family is. From the outside, the Watts family seems perfect. In social media videos, Chris plays the part of a loving husband and doting father to Bella, four, and three-year-old Celeste, also known as Cece. My daddy is a hero. Hey, guys. We're here from the boat today. Shanann is a social media maven and master of the digital stage. I am so excited. I'm driving with you. She was fun, full of life. She did so many things. She had her hand in everything. Love you guys. Have a great day. Just about every waking moment of Shanann's life streams live over Facebook. Chris and I are sitting here Toronto? waiting to board our flight to Miami. We're going to Toronto in June. If you were from the outside looking in, she seemed to have the perfect life. She did. Did you believe that she was happy? Absolutely. Chris is a field coordinator at a local oil company. I love the hat. Shanann loves sharing their love story, which started, not surprisingly, on Facebook. I got a friend request from Chris on Facebook. Well, one thing led to another, and he's the best thing that has ever happened to me. Say hi, Cece. Hi, Daddy, Daddy. <laughs> How was Chris as a father, as far as you could see? He was a very loving father. As far as I knew, he loved his family.
Thank you.